play going into the competition. Why did they discuss in the first place? We never go around 100 meters or something <laughs> like that. Why did they discuss in the first place? Uh, honestly, I tried sprinting, but before sprinting, I was a high jumper. What? I did high jump, I did a little bit of a long jump. So, <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I, I, did, I did high jump. I did high jump for like a year at Rossi's High School. And then it didn't really turn out too good. So I did sprinting in the off season. Um, that wasn't looking too promising either. <laughs> so I took up touring. I took up touring and did the discus and the shop put. And uh, after the one year I received doing the discus and touring, I went to St. Diego. Then my career, you know, it started looking promising, started excelling exponentially. And uh, that's where it took off from. Wow. Wow. Um, when we read that you were doing football, I laughed and I said to someone, yeah, man, if him ever throw the football, I'm sure the disc is it, 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 it's like a reach his body supposed to reach. Um, you said afterwards that you're not too certain what you're going to do. Does that mean that you're done with track and field and are, are you, because you, you said you're not too certain what you're going to do. Um, does that mean that is you don't know if you're going to go football or it means I might leave track and field or not track and field, leave field. Yeah, yeah, good. I'm not leaving field, but I think I think uh, now that I'm Olympic champion, people are looking out for what I'm gonna do next, especially because I did so well and everybody enjoyed the competition. Um, you know, I made a name for myself, Roger Stone, you know, and uh, people are gonna wonder what I'm gonna do next and I want to see how well I could continue into the sport on what I can accomplish. So I think I'll, I'll still be throwing. It, it's possible, especially after the year that I've had this season, like I understand that I, I, I can be able to multitask uh, a bit. And um, even if I don't, then I'll, I mean, I'll do throwing full time. Well, it's, it, it's all like you still don't know what you're going to do because you say, you, you, you. yes, you, I like the mindset. I like the mindset way. Roger, I show you some people. And me did kind of name that factor in this part too. Because representing a country people is an honor where enough, enough, enough people that like say, oh, go up on the real stage, go represent my country. Go represent. So, playing for an NFL team is not the same. As representing a country, people and hear your country and them a play in front of 80,000 people. You know? That's a feeling way. It's hard to replicate people. All of them go to NFL and become a star. It's not going to be the same because America thing an idea. It's American sports. You're an America, you're American champion. Because we don't subscribe to them, to them about world champion now. That is no world champion, that's an American champion, so you can't compare people, so I like me like me like the mindset of these youth people. And I just know. Friend Mafi D with that terrible interview there with those terrible journalists. Or we call themselves journalists. And the youth them cool. You would maintain and this interview does reveal a lot about the youth. You does Nonchalant people, as I said, nonchalant. And you have a little freestyle mentality way. Me have it too, so. I like that, I like that, I like that a lot. Because you tell the people you to do the high jump. What? Long jump. <laughs> Sprinting. <laughs> now you throw in and one big throw, one big fling people, and it's a goal, so. This you people this youth have a mindset of not giving up and we can do it man that no work i'm gonna do the next thing i have to make it and it's a brilliant brilliant way to look at life people brilliant way roger stoner and roger stoner story and he would say he and i want to complain people because them ask him how him experience over paris and we know everybody that complain everybody that complain tough bed tough this and he would have said, man, I want to complain. I'm just going to compete. And he now have a privilege to complain. That he would say. Because your first Olympics. And I, and I just saw people stay generally, you know. Especially athletes, you know. And superstars, you know. You see, when they're hungry and they're young, there is no complaint. But as them get them superstars and them, 
the fear money, hype and the prestige. Everything is a problem now. Everything is a is a hinder to them accomplishing them goal. All of a sudden. And you not tell the road the people. You to say yo. I don't complain, I just do what I need to do. Do what I need to do and I'm successful. And NFL, I don't love the youth, I love make youth compete, make youth be a NFL. Sign up the youth. Please sign up the youth, man, and make youth do it to all them people because the youth are well talented people. Well, well talented. That's why youth did no same, did Afi. He did Afi be successful in something. Long jump no work, high jump no work, sprinting no work. Discuss work, gold medal, record. Jamaica most yeah, that's a successful athlete athlete at this uh far beaten Olympics yeah. <laughs> yeah Stone I was Jamaica most successful athlete people in you know, most far beaten and controversial Olympics of all time. Yeah. Telling the motor controversy that it's a Olympics uh, it's it, it not funny. It don't funny people so we like that, we like that Roger Stone. We like the mindset. We like the simplicity where you just see life through you. We like that people. We like that. And this was a brilliant interview. It just you know, you want more lot. You want more lot people to if you was them. If you was them see. The mindset of a champion. This is a champion you people and can't wait. Can't wait. And this week, people, this week I under 20 championship. And me, I look out for some people, you know. Don't know any people. We look out for card, grey card. Once see that youth, they car. A lot of people are talking about him. I just watch him. I just watch him at a distance, you know. See what I do. Then me review people because he look outstanding so far. No doubt about that. Very outstanding at least. Promising. And. I went uh, 27, I suppose the 27 under, under 20 championship and I want to see gold, gold people. Now I'm going to contest the 100 meter, but I'm going to contest the 200 meter. So that's going to be nice, that's going to be special too. So can't wait for that people. Can't wait for that start off, kick off. Let me see where Jamaica is going with. How the future look. Because they never look that promising in the Olympics, people. I'm not telling no lie. The future no look all that bad people. I don't nah, nah tell no lie, I don't nah play. I don't nah play pocket. You see it, our future no look all that well going forward. So, you can see whether you can do it. Inspire me and give me some belief. Say, Jamaica can reach back. Jamaica can reach back at top people. So, that's yes, something I left on the people. If you don't want to see more, when you can go read it, when you can go watch your interview, you can tell me, worth it, man. It's worth the watch. It's worth the watch. Reggie, yo, you is just a, you know, <laughs> one of them at least, the people here just say, yeah. Yeah, you know, if I was at least, if I was at least, this would be me. Just simple, calm and collective, a soak in the atmosphere. And let's enjoy your gold medal. So it's a beautiful interview, people. Beautiful. You can go watch your wallet, man. Rarity. Rarity watch. And more close panda note, people. More close panda note. Because I don't know. I don't know. Something. Something half. I don't know what. Like. I don't know how much the never win a goal like me. Yo, Jamaica media. Jamaica media when it comes to athletes. I don't know if I athletes them don't trust the media or what. But you know, I seen a whole heap of whole heap of interview. When a year I go on with Cherry Kafuli. When a year I go on with Shelly. When a when I seen a big up to Kishien. When a, when a, eh? When I seen a big thing for Pinak. When I seen a big Patricia Gay. When I seen nothing people. Just like yo, yo, I'm telling the people, you know, Jamaica is just a different, different type of country. It's like we never have no date to do nothing. <laughs> yo, be a piece of piece of interview, me just no big interview, no. Yo, all them big platform, yeah. Them big platform, yeah, tell me, say, cannot, cannot. 
call up on a day, call, yo, on stage, ER. One of your interview at least, you know. One of most can give people them platform and, yo, you just embarrassing people how we treat your own. We have to go up on the real stage, go 